Okay. Let's start magma. And here we are. I'm going to define a new ring. And this is a prayer ring. Now I'm going to define a linear code over this ring. Let's see what Mama can tell me about this. Uh, with linear code. I'm defining the five rows. Meanwhile, you can see that I am using the student version, the student version, but in fact the results that are going to be given are the same in the pro version. So uh, if you see a little bug or something weird, it's going to be the same in the pro version. This has already been proved. This is a beautiful generator matrix. Now you will see why. Let's ask Magma something about this code. So this is a cyclic linear code, and we have that this code has almost twenty thousand code words, and the minimum instance is one. This is very important. We have to focus on the minimum instance. In this case is one, and this is generator matrix in H1 form. So let's define another ring. Oops. And I'm going to define a new linear code. This is going to be a little smaller. Now let's see, uh, here the minimum distance is also 1, <coughs> uh, as I said, the, the, important, the main idea here, or the most important thing here, is the minimum distance, that we know the minimum distance. The cardinality, the cardinality is more than 3000, so this is a smaller code. I'm going to find an interesting code over the same ring as the first one. And we have code and we have code. Let's know a little about this code. We can see that this is also a cyclic linear code. So the two codes that I have defined are cyclic. And the cardinality of this set is bigger than the second one, but smaller than the first one. 
but we don't have the meaning of the instance. We can see the generator matrix only has only four groups, so maybe Magma is using some property for the matrix to find the minimum distance. And this is why it's very fast. As we can see that the time computing this code is, on, is practically zero. But this is really weird because now if I want to know the minimum distance of this code, um, I will have to check code word by code word, which obviously I will not do. So I think I will try something much, much better, like Sage. <laughs> 